Hey everyone, I'm Jackie Moran, and thank you for meeting me on The Mile for my live stream series here, where affordable fashion meets high fashion, and it's all happening in one incredible place, and that is The Mile. So I want to talk to you about this brand new app that I've been talking to you about throughout my 12 episodes here on my live stream series, and this pretty much is the ultimate destination for anyone who loves shopping fashion here is where you can do it. Because not only can you watch, you can shop, you can scroll, you can even star on the mile. If you love shopping, you can turn it into basically your own e-commerce store. So for all of my influencers out there, if you want to turn your love for shopping on the mile into your own business, then you can do exactly what I'm doing. Share your love for fashion, and I'm sharing it with all of you. So I'm watching the chat. I want to see out there who's live with me and who is chatting fashion with me on this fabulous Friday. I'm here in New York talking some amazing under 100 steals, some amazing splurges. And today's theme, by the way, is all about that minimal modern trend that it seems so effortless and easy, but you just have to shop the right pieces. And once you have them, you can put on your fashions and look so chic and speak volumes without saying a lot. No colors here. We did a huge color show last week. This is like the antidote to that. And I love wearing both, by the way. So we are going to be ready to go. I see guest three. 311 is joining here saying, or 331 saying, I'm so buying that outfit. I see guest 41 joining. So uh, definitely let me know in the chat what you're loving and what you're buying. I know that this outfit is crushing it right now and we're going to talk about it. But I just want to remind you, obviously, if you're shopping, don't forget that you can actually purchase seeing all of you saying you want to buy my outfit. Just know where to do that. There's that little shopping bubble at the bottom of your screen or on the right hand side if you're watching on a desktop. Click that little shopping bubble and you will see all of the products kind of explode for you to shop and you don't even have to leave the stream. And I see another guest is saying, oh, that's so smart and I want it. Yes. So let's let's get into it. I want to remind you, of course, that right here you can shop your favorite brands from your favorite influencers and your favorite creators all in one place. I am proud to be one of those. And I also want to remind you before we get into the minimal modern finds of the summer about this amazing handbag giveaway, because guess what guys, I am almost into the end of my 12 part live stream series. I only have a few episodes left. And do you know what that means? I see as a guest is saying that you love the Navy. Me too. It's actually called shadow, this color of this dress. And it just elevates it that little bit from your usual go-to black dress. So I'm wearing it, by the way, with black and cream espadrilles. So don't think you can't put navy and black together. We're going to get into all of that. But let me remind you, with just a couple episodes left of my four dollar Bottega Veneta handbag. Now, don't you like the sound of nothing for this handbag as opposed to $4,000? It is well worth it with that gorgeous latticework leather. One of you out there is going to be the lucky winner of this giveaway at the end of my 12 episodes. Just a few more to go. And yes, I am selling the espadrilles that you're seeing in the screen. They are my splurge of the show. So I might be, I might be saying sorry to you once you're buying them. Your bank account may love me or may not love me, but you may get quite a few entries into the giveaway if you do decide to splurge on these amazing Stella McCartney wedges today. But for every $100 you spend, you're gonna get one entry into the giveaway for my Bottega Veneta handbag right here worth $4,000. Now, if you've seen me hold it up over eight or nine episodes or so, you've seen that it actually matches every single outfit that I have held it up with, no matter how casual, dressy, beachy, uh, you know, fall-like denim that I've even worn, it matches everything. So for every $100 you spend, you are going to get that entry into the giveaway. It might make you feel better about a little bit of splurging that you might be doing on the show. And hey, listen, we only live once, so I'm all for a little splurge here and there, especially on a handbag, by the way. Uh, but also, if you don't want to splurge at all and you just want to watch the fashion fun and chat along with me, I welcome that. And you can also simply enter by sending in a postcard. So all you have to do is send in a postcard and you can also be entered. You can find more information on my landing page. Use the hashtag right there, the mile giveaway on social media. Hashtag the mile giveaway so you can get in on the fashion chat and so that we know you're out there 
uh, excited about this giveaway, which is coming up soon, guys, from Bottega Veneta. So I see so many out there are joining right now. We've got to get into so much fashion. We got to get started with our shopping on our ultimate shopping destination. That is the mile. So let's get into it, you guys. I have so many amazing finds today. And you know that I want to talk about this dress so badly. Okay. Welcome to my silhouette of the summer season. I actually, truth be told, now own multiple dresses in this silhouette. It is the one shoulder, I call it the almost maxi because it is kind of hits at my ankle. So if you're a little bit more petite, it might be a true maxi. If you're a little bit on the taller side, it might be a little bit more of that midi meets maxi. I call it the almost maxi. It has this one little subtle cutout, which I have a solution for, by the way, if you're not into cutouts, that's coming up for under $100. But it is so modest and so simple, and it's all elasticized right here. The one shoulder is all elasticizing around the top, around the waist, and then the tiered flowy linen construction of this dress. It's called Shadow. It's looking pretty navy on your screen right now. It is Velvet by Graham and Spencer. You're going to see it as the Giselle dress in your little shopping bubble there. And it is 100% linen. You will have this in your closet for the next 10 years, as you've heard me say about many of my finds, because I want them to be trendy, but I want them to last. You will be able to pull this out and go to dinner in the Hamptons, which I'm dreaming of. Maybe I'll be doing that soon one day, let's hope. Uh, in 10 years, you could do it right now. And everyone will say, you look so chic. Where did you get that outfit? I want it. So simple. You throw it on, you go. I call it a one and done dress. And it makes such a statement with the elevated modern silhouette. And that's how you do a minimal neutral in a trendy modern way. So that's the whole point of this show all coming together in my first uh, dress of the episode, but we've got plenty more to go. And so I do want to remind you guys, I am in an, um, you could, I could definitely rock the extra small to small in this one. There's room in it. So if you're wondering about sizing, you could definitely go true to size. You could even potentially size one down so that you have it a little bit more. It's all elasticized. You have a little bit more fitted to the body. Now, before we get into my splurgy espadrilles, which are Stella McCartney and they're fabulous, I want to show you a little trick. For under $100, how you can make this velvet dress turn into an even more of a statement and you can cover up the cutout. And that is with your rattan belt right here. So every woman out there, I'm gonna just tell you this, I have one and I'm showing you one right now. You need to have a rattan belt for spring and summer. It's just a must have because of all of the trending that's happening with straw accessories. And now look at how eye-catching this look just became from going from super minimal to still minimal, but totally accessorized for summer where it just creates a wow pop at the waist. It'll cinch you up. It'll give you a breakup to all of the monochromatic and boom, then you have a completely eye popping, eye catching statement for summer. This is under 100 from Mestiza, New York. It is all 100% rattan right here. I never really say that word out loud. I say rattan. I hope it sounds right. Um, but you guys think of it even like, yeah, like your wicker furniture in a belt. That's what this is. And that's what we're seeing in our shopper totes for hundreds and hundreds of dollars in our shoes, in our accessories for our hats. Everything is raffia right now. So to do it in a way that's under 100 and be able to cinch all of your summer looks in a neutral way that works with everything on my rack behind me. Uh, it's such a fun pick me up. So if you don't have a rattan belt, this one for $78 from Mestiza, New York is so well made. It fits everyone because basically the whole thing is your belt loop. You could, you could cinch it any which place here in this woven construction. So you can customize it and fit it to you. One size will fit most. So check that one out in your little shopping bubble. Now I'm gonna keep building the picture with some more under 100 accessories. Let me know which pieces you're loving as we go, but are you ready for chic or neutral shades? Well, I found them for you. For I call it the steel of the show. That's why I got to these next because these are by Mott 50. It's a brand that I'm absolutely loving. They have tons of swimwear with their uh, sort of UPF built in. These are 100% UV protection, of course. These are the Gabby. They're the oval sunglasses in Safari. So they feel like that traditional black celebrity type sunglass, 
However, it's a safari warmer brown neutral that just gives a little bit more warmth to the body and just flatters you in such an amazing way. And that oval eye catching shape still feels like the effect of your oversized shades, but in that more sort of vintagey, cool, chic manner. So I love these because they are $59. They are my steal of the show, my under 100 find that I am obsessed with and crushing on. And they are so well made and gorgeous and easy. You see that I love the color of that brown neutral right there. So there's tons of ways to do neutrals, starting with black and white, but we are bringing them all in. We're bringing in the brown tones. We're bringing in the straw tones. We're bringing in the neutral navies. Uh, I still consider that a neutral. Put it all together and mix and match it. Everything goes together. So in terms of like my color show from last week, this show, it's everything goes. There's nothing you can do wrong with all of these neutral tones. And that's why you love having these in your wardrobe. You should have a little bit of everything. When I get dressed for camera, I love to have my brights and my standout styles. Well, these styles are just as stand out and they're your basic uh, pieces in functionality, but they look anything but basic. And that's how we are mastering minimal modern today. So let me know what you think of my $59 shades right here in that really cool oversized oval shape. I always try to find you really awesome affordable shades here for all my shows because I wear shades so much. And a girlfriend of mine was saying, please tell me how you do this chic, like on the go mom look where I pretty much put on no makeup and throw something on. Wait, there you go. Shades throw on this dress, you can look chic and finished and you've spent about 30 seconds getting ready. So I'm just throwing this out there for my girlfriend who I know watches these shows and was asking me, uh, how do you do it? It really is actually fairly easy. You just have to have the right pieces at your fingertips. And that's what these shows are all about because you can shop them. And that's super fun because we love shopping. Okay, so I've got my shades, my under 100 shades. I've got my belt. I've got the look going. I promise I'm getting to my splurges, but have a few more under 100 finds that I want to show you because you know I love my under 100 fashion. If you want to keep building the story, then check out. Now look at how these hoops just added dinner time uh, vibes right there. So you're going maybe from casual daytime to dinner time. Add some hoops. You know I love hoops. I talk about them a lot on my shows. But how do you do them in a minimal neutral way for summer? Say hello to these bamboo two inch hoops right here that have all of that neutral earthiness to them, but still look so elevated. These are by Kenneth J. Lane. He, you can't go wrong with all the Kenneth J. Lane accessories on the mile. I absolutely love shopping them. And I, may I remind you also the experience of shopping on the mile, I'm having that experience with you by doing this show. Every time I open a box, I wait until my mom and my sister are around. We all open them together. And we all decide we want to shop a million things because it's so much fun to unbox your finds on the mile. You'll never be disappointed. I really have not been disappointed yet in terms of when you see something on a screen and then you get it at home. Sometimes you're like, oh, no, all of these finds do it justice on screen and then even better when you unbox them. So these are from Kenneth J. Lane in that tan bamboo tone perfect casual earthy modern vibes for the summer and these are by the way $55 so right here guys my under 100 steals of the show are speaking to you in those earthy warm brown neutrally tones and textures beyond between the raffia and the bamboo you're getting so much added texture to these minimalized looks as well all of those little details matter and putting it all together is what speaks summer, right? By seeing the rattan, seeing the bamboo. These are all those summer things that, uh, textures that really help lend itself to creating an eye-catching look that's very, very simple to put together. So check those hoops out in your shopping bubble if you love them. Now, so be it for me not to have an amazing hat almost every show because we are in the summer season. And so I'm gonna keep going with my love for hats and fedoras because I found an under 100 fedora. It actually is the fedora of the season that you're seeing blitzing everywhere on your screen, on influencers, on social media. Uh, what is the brand? How do you get it? What's it all about? So this is $99, it's under 100. It is a handmade in Mexico by artisans in Mexico, 100% baked palm leaf, UPF 50, 
tightly woven, amazing straw fedora. So it creates the feel as if you were shopping in, if you're lucky enough to be vacationing in Mexico and you've been shopping a little bit and you come across that local stand and you see that localized feel of that handmade piece, that to me is what this hat brings to life. But because of the mile where you could discover your new products, save your favorites, get those personalized recommendations, they bring you that sort of Mexican artisan vibe right to your fingertips on your desktop. So that's what I love about doing partnering with the mile and doing this kind of show for you is that you get these really special trending pieces and you don't have to travel far and wide. They come to you. So this is a combination of two very high end brands that are, you know, very respected brands for summer fashion. And that is solid and striped. You know, I talk about them a lot meets lack of color. And this is your fashionista fedora that you will actually see. This is the one that people are actually wearing all over social media. So I had to, I've had a few versions of it on my previous shows. I had to bring you the actual one and it is under a hundred for the smaller size profile brim. Just one thing to note about this hat is that it is actually size small, medium, or large, extra large. And because it is that tightly woven, um, it has that uh, brim on the inside to give you even more comfort, it has a bit more of a rigid fit. It's meant to fit a little bit higher on the head, as opposed to the fedora that kind of goes low over your eyes. It's meant to sit up a little higher on the head. So when you get it and you feel like it has that rigid fit, it's meant to be that way. And so because I have quite a dome on me, as I like to call it, <laughs> I see guest 331 is saying love it or 131. Sorry, guys, I try to read the little writing my best as I can as I'm talking to you live. Uh, but I'm so glad that you love it. Uh, I am in the large extra large to give you the heads up on that because you definitely is this not screaming? I went shopping in the Hamptons, but I did it on the mile. I mean, this whole show to me is like the dream ham I, I i grew up going out to i'm a new yorker so i grew up going out to the hamptons and loving those visits for summer very special moments and memories in my life and those dream boutique windows where everything's black and white and chic and amazing and that's like your dream wardrobe right there add in a few fun pops and patterns along the way but that wardrobe that you aspire to that's what this whole show is in honor of that sort of dream chic look in that minimal, easy, eye-catching way. So we're going to keep the fun going. I've showed you quite a few under 100 finds here. Uh, so let me know which one has been your favorite so far. I'll pop my hat on the side for a minute because now we have to get to the splurges because this is affordable fashion meets high fashion on the mile. And we're going to say hi to this luxury fashion right now because it is such an amazing piece. Uh, you get two because you need two pairs, uh, two in a pair of shoes. But guys, th these crochet espadrilles from Stella McCartney, another capsule collection piece, by the way. Yeah, they're a splurge. They are $795. They are amazing. They are totally that go for it splurge if you want to go for it. I'm not going to pressure you, but if you do, you're not going to be sorry because Remember, that's about seven entries into the giveaway for your Bottega Veneta handbag behind me, if you want to think of it that way. These are special, unique. They feel like a collector's piece, like a cap capsule piece. They feel it. So when you see that in the construction of fashion, these are the kinds of splurges I say are worth it to add them to your wardrobe. They're so amazing. They have, you know what? I'm going to have to take one off. I got to hold it up for you because you got to see just how amazing these crochet wedges are, the workmanship. So they are sizes 35 to 41. They are that lace-up crochet espadrille. And they have that Stella McCartney sort of logo, like iconic taping going on in the lace-up style. The jute construction meets the, this is actually a recycled poly right here, that crochet heart detail the traction sort of lug sole, if you will, and they're not even heavy for all of that put together. They're not even, look at how much shorter I just got. Wow, if that's not a height increase right there. Check that out. But you don't feel it because you've got all that platform in the front 
And so these are so comfortable. I have had them on and I forgot I'm that much higher in the world right now. Uh, you definitely get amazing height with these. So for all of my petite gals out there that want that extra height, this is also an answer to that. But they are constructed with that recycled poly into the jute, into that rubberized sole. Um, so I see guest 331 is saying, I love them. How much taller would I be? So how about a hand taller? They didn't have the exact description uh, in, in inches, but it's about a hand right there. So I would say you're getting almost five inches out of this. And they because you're getting all that platform in the front, it cuts off about that much. So you're, you're looking at what probably feels like a three inch heel, but giving you more about five inches right there. That's all estimates by, by my fashion eye for you. But I'm telling you, this is a straight up collector's splurge Stella McCartney, it says it all over the lace-up sandal, so you you know they're designer. They are amazing, and if you are going to splurge today, that is my splurge of the show. So now, while I took one off for you, I am going to show you one other option for that more casual go-to sandal that I am, ob see, I just got so much shorter again. Uh, I'm obsessed with in this show, and so while I have my shoe off, I won't do it twice. I am going to show you the other, my other footwear love of the show. And I see that a guest is saying I'm all about the platform. Uh, and so uh, another guest is saying you can never be short, though. <laughs> That's true. And there's no such thing as short, right? Some of us are more petite. Some of us are on the higher side. It's all good. And all the fashion goes with all of our sizes and silhouettes these days. So there's nothing good or bad about being shorter or taller. And it all works for all of us. Now, can we talk about my other footwear love? from my minimal modern show. Can you take in the cream? Can you take in the cognac? Cream and tan, cream and tan, cream and tan. Mark it in the brain because cream and tan is that ultimate neutral color blocking combination to give you that little bit more vested interest in your footwear, so, or anything. Uh, in fact, I've had a pair of footwear uh, for probably almost 10 years that were black and white and cognac and they lace up. And because of all the neutral color blocking, I've been able to wear them with everything. And I've gotten probably hundreds, if not more, that maybe thousands of compliments on them. Had them forever, but they're just that much more interesting to the eye when you have a little bit of color blocking built in. How smart is it to color block in neutrals? So I see a guest is saying sandals, they're everything that I wear. How's the sole? Okay, so let's talk about, by the way, look at how flexible they are. Let's talk about what these are. These are like... And I hope I'm saying that correctly because it's a Greek sandal right here. So another thing that, um, and by the way, they are under 150 and they are a Greek construction sandal right here, European construction, amazing, super soft and buttery. You just can feel that uh, beautiful leather right there. They're just super soft and you just like, actually you could see it on the raw side. Now this to me is, it reminds me of getting sandals in Italy. Okay. You just took the words right out of my mouth. This is, I actually have done trips just to be able to go sandal shopping in Europe. And it is, okay, that's not the only reason you go to Europe, but it's something you look forward to if you love fashion. In the summer, uh, this, that is just a like bucket list thing is to buy those handmade sandals in Europe. Now, these are super soft, super flexible. You could feel that construction. Again, you don't have to be walking the cobblestone streets of Positano or any of those amazing places. But if you are going, if you have an extra ticket, I am available. I'm always available for that kind of trip. But these are uh, Greek brand, Laïque, under 150. And you will be able to like wear these forever and with everything, sizes 5 through 12. So these on the back say, made in Greece. I don't know if you can see it, uh, but I promise you. And there's even a little bit of like rubberized traction on the back end there. So let me just pop one on for you to show you how cute this would be with my rattan belt, with your straw hat, with your, and I love the toe loop style. By, do you see that? You see why these needed to come into my closet? It was just a necessity. Some things are just a necessity in life. And they look so incredible if you, are they true to size? Okay, so that's the other thing I wanted to tell you. So I would say yes, true to size, but I actually am trying on a 39 where I'd normally be a 40 or 41. And I'd be between the 39 and the 40. So if you are sort of that half size world and you're wondering, should you go up or down? I You can definitely go more towards the lower side than the, sizing up version because these are 39 I'd probably be truly more be a 40 but I even do fit the 39 because you don't want 
your foot to be sliding out of the toe loop. So definitely true to size, if not size down. And that would be my answer to you. Guess 161, but do you see how amazing they are and why I need to have them? Uh, you know, again, reminding you of the sizes, size five through 12. So the 39, you're going to see maybe that European sizing. I'm usually more of a 40, so I'd be more of that true 40 as opposed to 41. And I hope that you guys get in on these because they are absolutely amazing. Handmade uh, or made in Greece. It says it right on the back with that rubberized bottom, that buttery leather. You see all the workmanship, the toe loop, the two-tone. Oh, can't go wrong. You will have, again, a forever piece, a forever piece. Amazing, amazing, amazing. So let me know how you would accessorize your dress. Would you be more of the flat sandal wearer or would you be the wedge wearer? And I am, I see a guest is saying, absolutely love them. Oh my goodness. You cannot get enough of these. So that's why I'm showing you all of these are in the show because they are my loves. Everything that I show you are pieces that I get excited and I find them swoon worthy, but also pieces that I really think you'll get a lot of mileage out of. And that's no pun intended because we are on the mile right now. Uh, but I do choose my pieces, A, because you gotta love them, and B, because they can actually really transform your wardrobe and work for you. So again, obsessed with my heels, uh, with my flats right here, but I am gonna put my espadrille back on for the sake of wanting to feel a little bit more even in life. And you can, you can kind of eye both of them up as I do it and let me know which sandal is more your style. If you're more of the flats girl, are you more of the wedge girl? Uh, I feel you kind of need both. And if you're doing any summer vacays coming up, you definitely want to have an espadrille and you want to have a flat sandal. This kind of answers both needs right there. One's a little bit more of a steel, one's a little bit more of a splurge. And there's nothing wrong with a little bit of everything in your wardrobe and in your closet. So check these all out in your shopping bubble. And I see uh, definitely feeling sandals at the moment. These are such a good one. These are such a good one, guys, I'm telling you. I am obsessed with the sandal. Okay, like right there on the mile. So now that we've got a few ideas going, you may be wondering, where's my summer handbag for this look? I've been saving, saving sort of a good moment right here for not the best for last because you just saw how much I love all of those pieces, but, but this bag needs to have its own moment. And I feel now is the moment for you all to meet my new favorite bag because I have so many favorites. I am a handbag lover. Anybody who knows me knows that my splurges are always on handbags because I love the craftsmanship and I love splurging on them. So this one is by Bash and it is, I would say it's moderate. It's in, it's under 400 right here. It's in the $300 range, 395, but it is that amazing raffia meets the buttery leather, Italian leather, and this woven construction in all of these Italian leather accents, these are actually hand braided details. And it is sort of that bag. And I see guest 161 is saying, okay, wow, great size too. Exactly. I have had some really great wow bags throughout this series, this 12 part series here on the mile. And I don't want it to end guys because I am loving bringing you these weekly fashions, but the bags have just all been home run wow winners. Any one of my bags that I've shown you are truly worth, worth the buy. And this is an amazing size note that I do believe it comes in a smaller size. So this is the larger size. It's actually more, cost friendly if you do want the smaller size of course but i say this is your oversized chic timeless elegant shopping along the boutiques on the riviera if we're dreaming it's okay if you're not actually there uh but that is this is the silhouette and the size this is the scale of that statement bag that i want to really look Riviera level. But to me, this is Riviera level right here. I'm going past the Hamptons. I'm going all the way to the Riviera with this one because this bag is worth it. It is amazing. I love the, the mix of the leather, the city sort of vibe of the leather, Italian leather, meets that woven, airy, lightweight raffia. And I have it stuffed, but just know it's like completely foldable. I stuffed it so that you get a little vibe of how roomy it is, but Karina is saying, I love it. I mean, you cannot go wrong 
with this bag. Look at it with stripes. Look at it with light colored neutrals, your summer whites, your black and white, my, my navy fog sort of shadow dress here, my Giselle one shoulder dress by Velvet by Graham and Spencer. Don't forget about that one in your shopping bubble. But it is a go with everything bag, as many of my bags are that I show you. And because of the sort of raffia neutral, you can mix all tones of neutral and straw and it all goes together. So you know what? Let me just grab this guy real quick again so you can really get chic and have a moment. So now we're feeling it, aren't we? So where we started with the clean dress and no accessories, look at where we've come together over this half hour talking about fashion. And so I know I can go on and on and on. I'm gonna show you a few more quick finds uh, before we leave here for our weekend, everybody. And a couple of more one and done pieces that I'm absolutely loving on the mile right now. One of which is the utility jumpsuit. So this one is Splendid by Stella Jane. It is the utility jumpsuit. It actually, uh, I see a guest is saying ready for Italy for sure. I am so ready. Anybody who wants to get some tickets on board, let's talk about it. But this is your wear on repeat as they call it jumpsuit. You know why? Let me just show you real quick. Oh yeah, because it's all snap buttons. It is so easy to pop on and off in that neutral putty color. It is roomy. It is belted. It is easy. And it is truly, you put it on and you look instantly chic. You throw it on with your two-tone sandals. You throw it on with your sneakers. You throw it on with your wedges. Even you could wear it in a dressier form. You can give it some gold accessories. It is just, a, uh, I see, by the way, a guest is saying amazing classic bag. And I want that too. Thank you for the directions for summer. Great style. Well, this truly is where anyone can wear it wardrobe and just truly look rich and luxe. That's what this, they're, they're calling it like young money trend where you just look sort of, it's a little more refined, but in that refining yourself, you actually look more luxe and more rich and more elevated in your wardrobe. So that's the whole idea beside, behind my dream Hamptons minimal modern wardrobe of today and sort of the antidote to my bright colors of last week which you could go for a little bit of everything in your wardrobe but this is a super easy one this collaboration i'm loving i can't get enough of the Ella jane collection from splendid this is under 200 it's the color is called shore but it actually comes in other colors as well extra small through extra large uh the the small because i have a longer torso super easy to rock you throw on these safari shades right here for under $60. Throw on this jumpsuit, one and done look for like all of time, end of time. Doing errands, running about, throw it on with white sneakers. Grab it, even go on the plane. I wear jumpsuits on planes and I'm not afraid to do it. You just got to be careful when you go to the bathroom. But guys, all about it. Such a cool transitional look. Everyone should have that utility jumpsuit in their closet. It's seasonless and it's effortless and it's got snaps and pockets and it's and it's super fun with the short sleeve cut all right so that one is a really fun one to check out in your shopping bubble wear it on repeat and this one guys might actually be sold out but it is so super cute it is from tanya taylor it is a cut out knit midi knotted mini dress right here it has a slit right there it's a knit and it's that chic maritime blue stripe with the cut out cold shoulder uh, again, just another example of easy, minimal ways to create interest. So just with a classic stripe, with a little bit of cutout, the knotted detail, effortless, you throw it on and you go with the one and done options that I'm showing you. Just have all the right details to make it sort of timeless and situational as well, where it, meaning situational meaning you could wear it anywhere. You could wear this with sneakers doing errands. You could wear it at night with heels. You can look very yacht ready, uh, picnic ready with your with your wedges and, and so on and so forth with a jean jacket. So many ways to wear. This is Tanya Taylor. Guys, if it is sold out, just know I try to show you all my fashion finds before they do get sold out. But you know, if they're great picks, they're there for a reason on the show. So you guys gotta get shopping. Uh, another one that I love right there. Now, last thing we're gonna talk about is sort of swimwear beachwear. We can't forget about our swimwear and our beachwear. And this might be my favorite bikini yet. I know I kind of say that about all the things that I'm finding, but that's because I fall in love with all of them. And that's why I bring them to you. This is from Anine Bing. I want to buy her whole swimwear collection. Literally. There are so I'm gonna actually do a whole swim show and there's more Anine Bing to come. But talk about doing a subtle print, again, cream and tan, that chain link print, it is still totally neutral, cool, 
and it has that bandeau style with that ring front detail and it even has the ring details on the hip as well these separates are under 100 100 and under and it is like a second skin it is a double layer buttery soft second skin material almost like those leggings those workout leggings that you love in that second skin material that is what this swimwear is it's a recycled nylon actually and this is bikini ready i love the fit it gives you moderate coverage unlike many of the fits out there that cover nothing i always size up in swimmer as well so i would go for the medium if not you know medium into large for me for swimwear because the material is so small to begin with i go up but know that this comes in extra small through large i am rocking the medium and I'm not afraid to rock it. I'll even go large if I have to. There's no problem with, don't have that size shame or envy or needing to go for a certain size. Wear what fits you and what is comfortable and be proud and smile along with it. Uh, and go, you know, have a good time. Uh, this is that kind of bathing suit that is just that, that it bathing suit in a amazing, it's trending the bandeau, but it's also super classic. So classic, chic, elevated right there. Anine Bang, I'm uh, crushing on this bikini right there. These separates are 100 and under in that creamy neutral concoction, that chain link print. Now, what might you wear that with? Don't neglect your basics and how to give take them up a notch, right? So I'm going to show you a few under 100 tanks real quick. From This one's from Hudson. And the trick with the tank right now, which we wear our tanks a lot in summer. So I wanted to give you some interesting ones. This one by Hudson, it's a cutout tank. It comes in multiple colorways, by the way. I believe it comes in more of a sage and a black, but this creamy white right here, pop that over your bandeau, uh, put it on with the skirt I'm about to show you. And there's so many cute little midi skirts and beach skirts and even maybe a knit pant that you might need that perfect basic for. This one by Hudson is a great example of taking just any old tank top and giving it a look and giving it a little bit of fashion with the cutout detail on that one. The, the fabric is ribbed, super soft. It can be tucked. It can be worn with many different types of separates. And I also want to show you, speaking of super soft, this asymmetric one shoulder tank by uh, Anthony Thomas Melillo. And if this is not the softest fabric I've ever felt in the history of time, under 100, it's actually micromodal fabric, ribbed fabric that's made in Peru. They only have this machine, only this brand uses this machine to make this super soft fabric. It's crafted from a 10 cell fabric. It's a micromodal, they call it. I, if you get this home, you'll see what I'm talking about. It is gentle, lightweight, breathable. I would size up in this one because it's more cropped, comes in extra small through extra large. Pop it on with a little cute skirt, like this tie front white summer skirt, velvet by Graham and Spencer. It's the Lena skirt right here. If you pop that on, even with just your swimwear top, by the way, grab your beachy bag, throw on your two-tone sandals that are behind me or your wedges. And that again is an off the beach, amazing kind of look right there. Never veering from your neutrals and your safe zone. This is a functional tie waist and it actually is elasticized in the back. I'm obsessed. This is a hero summer skirt right here. Uh, it is uh, 169, so it is under 200. And you will wear this like you wear your favorite white button down shirt. It's extra small through extra large. I would definitely rock the small in this one, true to size, elasticized, 100% airy summer cotton right here, you guys. So in a nutshell, those are all of my uh, amazing loves of neutrals and minimal moderns right there uh, for you for spring and summer right here because we're really getting into it now. It's starting to get sizzling here in New York. We're getting into our summer vibe. So let me know out of all of those style finds, which one was your fave? Hit me up on social media. Don't forget to check out my landing page for this amazing Bottega Veneta handbag giveaway, which is coming very, very soon. Only a few episodes left here in my 12 part live stream series. So be sure you can enter to win with every $100 you spend or simply by sending in that postcard. And don't forget when you shop on the mile, you're shopping your favorite brands from your favorite influencers and creators right here, all in one place. So until next week, guys, I wish you happy shopping. Be minimal, be modern, be bold, be cool. And I'll see you next week. Bye.